Ow! My dear days, what is going on? What the heck is that? Honestly. Ike Theory. Your ability to run and jump is improved. I'll take it. And who are you, mate? Yeah. Hugin. I assume I'm having a Viking dream of some sort. Oh, hey, look, a stick. Hail, warrior! Hey, bugger off, you. You're bought, Hugin, you're bought. I bring tidings. You found the summoning place of one of the Forsaken. What the hell is that? Oh my god, he's trying to kill me. Are you throwing stones at me, mate? What is going on? I'll hit you. I'll have you, long shanks. Oh, he hit me! <laughs> Let's run away! <laughs> this is horrible. Stop throwing rocks at me, mate. I have one health left, it seems. Hey, there's a house over there. Maybe I can find shelter. A run skill has improved. Ah. Oh. Hey, it looks like chests. What's this then? An axe. I'll have that. Who keeps boar heads in a chest, honestly? Some weird people are living here. Not to mention deer trophies, deer heads. And stone could be handy, maybe. Hey, you're not supposed to die in dreams. What's going on here? Oh. Oh, I see. This is one of those nightmares where you can't wake up, is it? So what do you want, mate? Welcome to the tenth world, warrior. I am Hugin, sent here to guide you in your travels. The megaliths surrounding you are sacrificial stones. I'm I'm uh, opposed to sacrifice, Hogan, okay? Sorry. They represent the Forsaken, which you must slay in order to ascend to Valhalla. Um, okay, well, how about you send me back to my bed, maybe, Hogan, and I can wake up and go to work like normal. There's that guy again. All right. <clears throat> well, I got him. Hey, he dropped something. Great, gray dwarf eye. Maybe he's a gray dwarf. I think I think I've heard of gray dwarfs. Who's in here then? Oh, is that bloody raven again? Ooh, berries. Ooh, mushrooms. Wonder if I can eat something. Maybe that'll make me feel better. Maybe that'll make me wake up. I feel cold. Well, no wonder. I have no clothes on. You know what, guys? This... And girls, of course. Oh, you know what, folks? This feels right somehow. Maybe I... Oh, there's a nice cooking station here. Maybe I can take some of that meat that I found and... Maybe I can get some more food in my belly. I feel like I belong here now. I feel like 
Maybe this is what I'm supposed to do. I think the food was inside, wasn't it? Maybe I'll just stick around in this dream for a while and see see what I can see. Now this this raven is completely nuts. You have built the work I have not built the workbench. You're misinformed, Hugin. Never mind that. I'm sure that'll be fine in the end. How would I know when it's done, I wonder? The hay is beautiful here, you know? And what is that, though? That doesn't look normal. That looks almost like Yggdrasil that I, of course, read about when I was a child. The world tree that... from which all other worlds are uh, sprung on the branches and... It's actually normally impossible though to travel between these worlds unless if you're the squirrel you can go between worlds so that's why the squirrel is the messenger of Odin be wary of the weather I know Rick I need some like I need some clothes you know don't know if I, I, he, he just brings tidings all the bloody time this guy You've suffered... Hey, that was like... It wasn't my fault, even. You know? Come on. Here he is. That'll teach you. What? Ah. I'm getting, I think I'm gonna need a hang of this here, uh... Another guy here. I mean, I, I wouldn't say that I was cutting wood, but okay. A tasty morsel. Oh yeah, I forgot to eat my food, didn't I? I can probably eat this. Hey, I think my health is going up from this. I feel like I can, I can take on the world here. What's that red thing over there? Oh, is that maybe, uh, maybe where I landed after that horrible woman took me away? Take stock of your inventory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. I can sneak. And run and jump. Ow! Oh, so you were my death. You look so small and soft. Tell Odin he may have broken this form, but the wilderness will never submit to something. This stone is a vague evasive, a, a guide, right? If you inspect it closer, it will re reveal the summoning place of Eichthyr. Vague evasive means uh, way pointer, way shower. <laughs> yeah. So I can see my map here as well. Very nice. It's getting dark. I don't know. I don't remember if there was a a bed in here. Is he bringing tidings again? All right, I'll sleep. Okay, but you can't sleep in the same bed as me. Wait a minute. These, these beds are occupied. These are somebody's beds. I, I'm, I better not sleep in them then. Chests. There are chests all over the place, mate. Maybe I can build a bed. Nope. Not yet, anyway. <clears throat> Maybe I need to get some more wood to build a bed. How's that? What do you think? I, mean, I have 12 wood, it says here now. I must be like the strongest person in the world in this dream because I can carry 12 logs in my loincloth. How about this waterlogged log here?
Oh, this is hard work, guys. Hey, what does the hammer do? With this to your hand, you can raise high halls and mighty fortifications. I want one of them, then. Oh, and now I can maybe build a bed. Furniture, bed. Uh, I'll just bunk it down here. I mean, if they, uh, I'll claim that. Oh, okay, so now I can... What a lovely day it is. What a lovely day it is. Maybe I just need to pick up some more stone and... Oh, okay. It was him again. Hammer. I know I crafted a hammer. I just did it, mate. You didn't do it. I did it. How come you know about it? You're spying on me. I just need... You know what I need? I'm, like, I need... You know what I would love to get is some flint. I've heard that the... Hey, that's something. Yeah, see, there you go. Flint. Maybe um, if I think about something, it happens in this dream. But we'll see here, right? We'll see here. If I can find some more flint. Here it is. All the flint I could uh, want. And interestingly enough, there were many, many, many different ways to... Oh, right. Abbore in Swedish. I don't know what that, that sort of fish is called in English. Maybe maybe I can live on off of fishing here. That would be cool. Many, many ways to... To uh, actually get the flint into usable tools. Hey, that's a deer. Oh dear. Maybe I can get the bow and shoot deer later on for food. Um, one of the more interesting ones was uh, where they had a, a um, like a nugget of flint or a morsel of flint. They um, put another sharp stone on it and then applied pressure to sort of just make slivers of flint. Basically like a, a, a cheese cutter or something like that. And uh, that way they could make really uh, fine tools such as daggers out of flint and things like that. Interesting little bit of information here. Here's some more flint. Let's see. Oh, there's a little river type thing here or a creek maybe. It was such a bore, honestly. One of the most common uh, causes of death during the Stone Age was actually bore, bore damage. Apparently uh, they wanted to hunt them a lot, and of course the boar were of a different opinion. And uh, a conflict arose. Now. Violence between, at least the lethal violence between people in the Stone Ages was not very common. In fact, I think the first murder in Sweden that we've uh, got evidence for happened around where I live uh, at the moment. <laughs> and uh, it was uh, it occurred some 12,000 years ago. No, actually, let's, uh, let's see here. 10,000 years ago, and uh, the first people uh, moved into Sweden around 14,000 years ago. So it took 4,000 years for them to discover the fact that you can murder somebody. Oh, hey, I can make clothes. I need more leather scraps, so I need to find more boar, and I can make a bow, but I again need more boar. Make a flint knife, but I need more boar. But I can make a flint axe. Let's do that. Uh, 
And yeah, as I'm sure you've realized, guys, from the title and everything, we're playing Valheim here with some friends. Woo! Mantis and Bobbert for now. We'll see who else turns up. But uh, I've, I said to them, look, I want to start on my own. And uh, that's what I've done today. I've, I've just gotten the very basics together, made sure I can play the game, and took you for a little bit of an uh, introduction to Valheim here, if you will. I hope you'll enjoy this series. Uh, I know I normally play Minecraft, but I'm going to try and diversify a little bit and play some other games that I play a lot of on my channel as well. Uh, you know, I, that I play a lot of on my, in my free time. And it's going to be real interesting here, I think, to play with Mads and Bobber. Because we're going to be focusing quite a lot of, of uh, effort into building here in Valheim. <coughs> so for that reason, we're running the Valheim Plus mod. So yeah, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye!